So one of the guys that uh, organized this little community event is Ender Wigan. And I don't know if DA stands for district attorney or something like that, but uh, you know, whatever. I've never asked him. I should probably ask him that sometime. All right, so I'm gonna bring in Reds real quick. That'll be nice to do. Hey. Hey, Redsy, how are you, my friend? Good. I'm just gonna mute my stuff here so I can hear. Yeah, I, okay. I, I, I hopped into that uh, team speak, but I, like you, I'm gonna be muted for most of it. I, I think I might uh, unmute periodically, and I need to crank down that team speak volume so that obviously game sounds and whatnot are, are gonna be. Far more important to hear. So I don't know uh, exactly what the official start of this thing is going to be. Um, I think we're just basically going to play games and provide commentary. Uh, the way that we've got it set up is this is organized by Shack News. It's a Shack Battle, Shack News TeamSpeak, I believe. They've enabled the spectator features, so we get to fly around and, and check stuff out. And uh, you know, we, we get to see names over heads, all the good stuff. Awesome. What's the um thing uh, for uh, free fly or spec like to uh, flip just back. just hit your your use key I'd rather have whatever that might be oh, okay yeah whoever that is your volume is pretty low oh okay all right all right guys so I think with everything running you have on the right. oh, by the way can, can I just say thank you to the person that said hey yep. right hot you have been uh, using an old version of Fraps, and you're locking at 30 frames per second when you try to record. I'm like, yeah, that kind of sucks, because I can't do tutorials and stuff very well, because uh, 30 frames per second really destroys any mouse movement. Um, it's just not the same, right? But the new version of Fraps unlock it still records at 30 frames per second, but it actually unlocks the, the um, actual game Do FPS, so yeah, I can playing. actually, oh, we already have a plant down, yeah, so I can actually potentially play and provide, um, like, video tutorials and stuff, so, I'm kind of excited about that, thank you, forum user, I, I don't remember who mentioned that, but I really appreciate uh, that feedback, because I had just been using the same version of Fraps for ages, because, yeah, quite frankly, I need it to work. I just have soldier. You know, if Fraps doesn't work, then we don't have high-quality VODs, and that's bad, so... I might have to respec on my turn. All right, guys, we're already on to the second objective. I'm going to go hop in and uh, see if security can bring right, the old uh, Founders Council member all the way home. This, of course, is a, uh, a medic objective where this lovely council member here will have to trot his uh, limped ass all the way to a boat that's waiting outside. One the other day. Everyone's seen Aquarium. We don't really need to explain this map, right? Let's go check out the action. By the way, um, it's just me or do I guess my sounds seem a little bit off in terms of the, the mix. I haven't really touched much, so I'm not really sure what's up with that. Let me, let me crank maybe in the game just slightly. Give that a shot. Everybody over there sounds all right to me. Yeah, I'm, I'm just trying to get uh, my actual balance right. It just doesn't feel right. It's all good. It's all good. We'll, we'll sort it out. It'll be okay. They come, they come around. So, what I'm hoping yep. to get out of tonight is, um, obviously we're on TeamSpeak. There's also in-game voice. Uh, VoIP is on. And I don't really know why people are having such a hard time with in-game VoIP. Um, yeah, it wasn't, like... Well, it, it's quote-unquote on, but, like, the volume settings were such that it's really hard to hear people. Um, and I guess, I, right, see, it means that, you know, old people like us <laughs> who are very accustomed to having to, you know, tweak settings through a console, C-Vars, whatnot, I guess our day has passed and everyone wants a nice menu. Um, don't, know, don't really know what to say. People I seem to be incapable of turning care. on VoIP. I think I'll... I don't know. I'm used to it from Quake, but we never used, really used it in other games, so... Or it just came enabled. I but again, nobody talked. Right out of spawn. Yeah. yeah, it's I like force too. of habit. So it looks like, yeah, right now... 
pretty much easy easy going for this hostage, although Ender Wigan has just taken down one of the security folks trying to make the escort, and he also takes on hostage. So, this is a pretty good spot to try to keep... Uh oh Yeah, you gotta use that cover. Pretty good spot to try to keep the hostage um, pinned down, because this is one of those places where the security normally would ha Check have to be down. facing all kinds of uh, Ask me. disgruntling... Um, setup from the resistance, but it looks like that's just not happening. So here's a revive, and uh, we're just going to see Apocalypse Pony, as we've seen in uh, some other community adventures. Going to be escorting along with Dead Walking up above the Warhammer's taking the vent route, and let's see if uh, he's going to be spotted at all. No, not yet. So many kills he can just collect here. Apocalypse Pony is cleaning up quite a bit, and uh, let's go ahead and run the rosters as well. Uh, Dead Walking Horse Guy, Apocalypse Pony, Riptide, and Info Biter. Two meds are Apocalypse Pony and Dead Walking. Horse Guy and uh, Info Biter are the engineers, and Riptide is actually sporting an ops. Operative, very nice. Um, repair on a turret that is uh, offensively faced. We actually have a hubby, uh, hubby a heavy being run by. Burrow, Burrowura, something like that. I don't know. Ender Wigan is a medic. Uh, Muck Muck is also a medic, and the other soldier there, along with Burra, is Warhammer. She spread is sporting the NG kit for tonight. And we have another revive. So, Retsy, have you been getting a lot of uh, brink time in? Uh, not so much in the last couple of weeks. Um, I think I'm at a total of Thank seventy-four you. hours. Yeah. The release, sure. so. Has real life been keeping you down? Yes. Yeah. Work and reality. Sad. So Sad but true. Yes. Yeah. I hear you. Oh, okay. So they've got yeah, the objective works. almost at the top of the ramp. Yeah, they're getting past the really tough choke point Makes pretty easily, so hopefully we're going to do... I, I know that one of the focuses uh, of tonight is going to be a series of shuffles um, whenever teams seem to be relatively imbalanced. And I would say, you know, with 14 minutes on the clock, it's pretty safe to say that uh, security is quite a bit stronger than resistance at this point. Uh, and again, you know, the operative consistently using his abilities to clear the way. I'm, I'm actually really curious. Who's running this op again? It's going to be Riptide. Interesting. There's a lot of um, teenage so angst to get you on the pointed, <laughs> pointed towards the, uh, the operative when it comes to competition simply because uh, the usefulness compared to any other class seems quite a bit low uh, in a 5v5 situation, which that actually is what we're playing right now. Um, once again, guys, this is open to anyone. Um, check out the Splash Damage forums, the PC... Um, what do you want to call it? PC Community Game Night. This is uh, Shack Battle. And that, in fact, is the password. Because, you know, that's cool. Oh, you got me killed, under. <laughs> Sorry. And so, it still won't accept my vote. Already outside is the objective escort. Go. So, well, basically it's waiting for a medic to get him back on his feet. There he is. And uh, we're just moments away from seeing this thing completed. Let's see if Resistance can do one big push. Here comes the oh. big fat heavy. And can oh, Burrow get the hits in? He does take out both the objective and one of the security, but not enough damage done for... Uh, any sort of giving action, so we're seeing revives around the corner. That being said, here's a self-revive. Pocket Pony's back up. I think that's a Richie maybe in his hand. From behind. And it looks like sadly Burra actually TK'd himself. So <laughs> coming in, Ender. That being said though, most importantly though, we do have resistance setting up. Riptide from above. Yep. So, you know, at this point, you know, I think we can safely say 12 minutes, they should be able to get the hostage just a little bit further away. Um, my, you know, here are my biggest problems with this. Piece of cover here, piece of cover here, piece of cover here, uh, and even a piece of cover right here. Um, really got to use every ounce of cover you can get your hands on. The other great place to hide is actually in the ship itself. Uh, as defense, you can hop in there, and it's, you know, it's very hard to snipe you. 
Uh, in fact, you can actually sit back here and Sorry, just snipe away pretty well. You. So, I went the side. use it. the revive. Himself. Yeah, we're going to see this thing done right here. Mm-hmm. We all know who you're and there we go. So, 11 <laughs> minutes and 6 seconds on the clock as we finish off that Excellent aquarium work, round. That this is going to be objective-based gameplay, not stopwatch night. It's just a community-run night of fun. Alright, yeah, so it looks like we got yeah, a little yeah. bit of a shift in people it here. It's not super <clears> random. <throat> like, I just did a random command, but it's not super random. <laughs> They're talking about the, well, ra the randomized the teams. Team you guys all oh. Okay. So let me talk a little bit about uh, these rules the, uh, as we have the opening here. Again, the way the objectives work, and wow, we have not ever seen Security Tower except for day one, I think. Um, you got to first open this panel. No. Any class can open it. it. Looks like Warhammer's getting that done, and maybe it's Info Biter. But uh, panel opens, and then the soldier gets to run up and plant a charge. Warhammer should be taking care of that right now. He tosses a Molotov, actually. Gets uh, flamed, and Infobiter slides into him, knocking him down. Now he gets back up, and here comes the plant. So a little bit of uh, awesome noob action at that point. Turret going up, though, Infobiter. Gonna place it right in front. Yeah. Ready to be naded. That being said, though, a plant is down. Um, so, the way that these uh, particular rules work, now that we have a plant down, is um, essentially... ESL has removed tons of stuff, tons of stuff from the game. Uh, and everything ranging from self-revive to Wait, kind of the more obvious things like, um, no, you know, adrenaline. And, you know, that makes sense. Oh, we got a yeah, disarm. Cheese disarm. spread getting in there. And he will get the disarm. Very nice. But, uh, sadly, I think with those restrictions, while they do help make the game a little bit more... Um, offensively biased, it's just not enough. It's just not enough when it comes to um, making the game be brink. You know, it's, it seems oh, like it's uh, neutering the game down. At least that's the counter argument. And I, and I, I fall somewhere in that argument. Um, I mean, it, it's to the point where, like, uh, the Gatling turret's not available. Um, oh, got Warhammer with a second plant. About to get shot in the face, though, as soon as the turret turns around. As soon as Burr turns around, uh, down. yeah, did not turn around. Very important to turn around uh, whenever you drop in. Anyway, that being said, I uh, should have actually resistance starting to take this over a little bit. Let's see. Here comes Horse Guy waltzing down the side. Security trying to take over. They've got to get through hands, and he goes down. So we should uh, see a disarm. Oh, there's mine. a mine. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Muck muck with revive. Yes. No. Out of pips. Sadly, he might be moving on. Let's see what the time is on this bad boy. Eight seconds. Horse guy is down, waiting for a revive. And resistance has respawned. They're going to get this. Very nice. Very nice indeed. I'm trying to remember all exactly that's been removed, though, with these ESL rules. I mean, it, it is really restrictive. Operatives have pretty much no toys at all. Um, I think not even their EMP grenades, which is pretty much their most useful asset. Um... I always prefer to just die here, since you spawn forward on the offense, you can actually get past your defenders pretty quickly. I just bum rush, try to take out as many as you can. Here comes Riptide though, heading straight for the objective, and uh, nothing in his way so far. He spots an, a mine and tries to take it out. Horse guy needs to take him out, he does so. So, um, mine will stay intact just a little bit longer. Let's see, um, God, what else has been removed? Um, yeah, no self-reviving, no adrenaline, n no, no command post buffs, no, um, let's see, Caught one mine per engineer, happening. one turret per team, um, They're all great, let's per see, team. yes, per team, right, um, I'm trying to think what else, I mean, it's just, yeah, it, it's pretty restrictive, it is pretty restrictive. Put up side, didn't I and a lot of people feel that it's just you know, going a little bit too far. Again, I think it's useful now because things are way too um, de defensively biased. So, okay, make the game playable. That's fine. But when the game is far more balanced, then that's when you really do need to say, okay, let's re-examine these rules, hopefully, when the DLC hits, when the spawn time changes come. And, you know, try to tweak things back in. I'd rather the game be too offensive, if you will. And then, you know, tweak it for, um, you know, for 
whatever whatever needs fixing to to make sure that it, you know the defense doesn't get too strong. That being said, that being yeah, said uh, thoughts. Uh, I would have to agree with you. I think that a lot of the point of the game is to have some of these uh, buffs and abilities that they do have. So people already aren't using things like the operatives, so if you're going to strip every single Jason thing away Warren from them, right um, okay. it's not really useful to have them other than for objectives. So uh, there, there may be things that are, you know, Know, maybe a little one-sided, but I think it's more the objectives and the choke points and them, not so much the, the characters, right? So coming from Quake, there was different weapons and maybe some of the weapons were a little unfair, but uh, <laughs> yeah. everyone had pretty much the same abilities. Uh, and in this, everyone's got the same abilities, same weapons, same everything. So I think it's more how you use it. Yeah. So yes, hopefully when the, the uh, DLC comes out, they've fix the spawn times and that'll help hopefully clear up the choke points and maybe ESL can open up some more of the Sorry about that. The abilities. So yeah. Alright, well that being said we do have a pretty solid hold on this hack objective so far. Uh, it, it may let's see, yeah, resistance is just now getting there. This is the first uh, bona fide push have a charge, and don't driving. quite have a hack box down. Looks like Infobiter is about to get that done. Um, I do not know if we're playing with the hacking as a rule. That's a good question. Hmm. I wonder. But, uh, but, but that being said, um, we do have a, a hack beginning. Infobiter's all over it, and he's got three guys to keep him safe. I would like to see turrets and mines out here, though. Horses being able to revive folks. Security's pressing up the stairwell, though they got three guys pushing up now. Here comes their heavy. Her he their heavy should be leading, though. Horse guy is an engineer. Ender Wiggins should be back behind this heavy. And simply, like, it. I hate to say it, but this is actually a mechanic I like in Brink. Um, unlike previous games where you would just be tossing down uh, med packs and there. waiting for people to run over them, um, in this game, as a medic, you're literally a healer. You're literally an in-battle healer, and I know that makes some people cringe, but I actually like the mechanic. Um, because it means that, like, a as your guy is, you know, about to die, your heavy's about to go down, you can buff him, bring him back to full health, and it's, you know, uh, strangely enough, I actually played a healer when I played World of Warcraft, so maybe that's why I appreciate the medic so damn much. That being said, we do have another hack continuing. They're yeah, about. We've actually got uh, Warhammer and Riptide. Yeah, Looks 60 like they're just about done. Yep. And the provider is joining in. Now, I guess have you had a, uh, much of a, point, a chance to play with some of the hack changes? Are you are you uh, comfortable or familiar with uh, how those changed? Uh, I'm not familiar with how they changed because okay. I didn't start off playing operative much, but I was using it today, so I, I enjoyed <laughs> kind of fun that way hacking. Yeah. What's changed? Uh, you're a hacker. Um, yeah. So, so what they changed is engineers. They now um, dehack at a much slower rate than uh, in the original release of the game. So it is quite possible to recover some of your uh, progress. It's not like a just complete done deal that whenever you guys get wiped out on offense, you're back to zero. Um, you know, you probably get, like, say if you're at 80% when you get taken out, you'll probably get back there at, like, 50% or so. Maybe a little bit more uh, dehacked. So, so that's actually really nice. Um, it's, it's not perfect, and for 5v5, it actually is it's still problematic. So I think most... Um, most uh, leagues are still saying just no dehacking Don't period. Go that way. So, did you see who actually grabbed this thing? Am I following the right guy? Uh, I do believe that Riptide is carrying. Okay, let me get over to Riptide. If I can find it. It's just up on the balcony. Okay, there he is. Okay, so another thing that they changed is returning the any dropped package takes a long time. Look at this though, adrenaline being used, uh, keeping Rick tied up, he goes down, 
It looks like he did not have the package. Or maybe he did. Oh, yes, he did oh, have the package. Yeah. Down he goes. So, yeah, security is able to um, recover slightly, but this is actually a really bad place to leave this objective. Uh, they're going to have to make sure they do not get wiped out. Let's see if I can hop out and fly over. Should see a return in just a few seconds. Yeah, there they go. They got two guys on it. it takes a lot longer to return this thing. So, um, in this case, yeah, the, the courier objectives are much more offensively biased. And I think they work out a lot better in pubs. The final thing I'll mention about this is um, when you get up to this panel to actually release the dude from the infirmary, it takes, like, maybe two seconds. It, mm. It's a lot less. Um, you don't have to stand there in front of it and, you know, run the panel. Which makes sense because the, the escort part is really the meat and potatoes of this map. And um, so I, you it know. Is, yeah, and it's a very long walk back to, back to the... Uh, second part of the that objective. Yeah. Actually, actually, at the end of the game. Yeah, you, you know, we had to waltz them all the way back out. So, that being said, resistance moving up topside. And again, I'm not sure who's carrying. These are things that I love to see in some sort of patch. Um, Looks like it was Warhammer. Got taken out by two spreads turret. And looks like Fur Turkey is trying to set up a turret in a pretty bad place, to be honest. Uh, quite, quite exposed. Riptide drops the passcode, and it's right out in the middle. So this will pretty easily be returned, as long as security doesn't get. Uh, where's the Molotovs? That's what I want to see. That's a pretty decent flashbang. Should hit at least one guy. And here comes Razzle, heavy with a with a minigun. The objective is still out in play. We do have two spread though, with a very nicely placed turret. I like this placement. Um, very, uh, very solid. Really, it is vulnerable from this side right here, but as you can see, a lot of players don't follow to the right of the rock. We do have, uh, hands picking up the passcode, but turrets are up and about, so. Hands, let's go find him. Looks like he's behind this wall. Yeah, he's underneath the stairs. Um... Yeah, you know, really solid defense so far by the security. I was a little bit worried considering how quickly uh, they got planted on, but looks like they've been able to set up a hero hold mode at this objective. I like that Hans is being very cautious. He's not trying to dive in there. He's trying to wait for his team. Though now he gets the call and he's on the move. He needs to he's watch out. Own. Yeah. Got, got a little bit ahead of his team there. Here he comes, and it's pretty clear. There we go. That's done. Oh. Very nice. So yeah, m much much quicker um, sort of transmit time for that passcode, which is uh, quite yeah, nice. Yeah, that was very quick. It's quite nice. I mean, it, it balances considering that you've already done a panel, you've already planted, you've already um, <laughs> hacked, and this. then you got to do a courier. I mean, yeah, come on, please, for the love of God, it's make like that a little bit faster. Hundred meter courier, whatever it is. Yeah, exactly. Meters, long walk. Yeah. So I, I'm liking yeah, that we're seeing quite a few heavies uh, on both <laughs> sides. This is uh, <laughs> it is pretty funny when they slide though. It's like they slide two inches. <laughs> More like they're just falling down. Yeah. I tripped over one of my rolls. I don't know. All right. So let, let's go. Let's go and uh, find Netia, the pilot that we're trying to free here. Um, I love whenever I play this particular objective um, as offense. I push really far forward so that like cheese spread would already be dead as far as I'm concerned. I would have set up stuff. Um, this would be probably one of my first choke points because you can kill so many guys. Uh, I'm right near the command post, by the way. Um, you can kill so many guys that are just trying to rush up there, and as uh, resistance, you get there first. So, if you book it, you can make cool things happen. Alright, that being said, uh, we do have Nechiev getting escorted almost to this uh, this curved hallway, and I'm not seeing mines and stuff. This is another nice little feature. Watch damage enabled it so that uh, spectators can see mines, which is very nice. Um, yeah, I, I did notice that, actually. Yeah, Yeah, and good. sadly, I, I don't see any. So... That to me is problematic. That being said, taking my unit. He's taking there is a unit. turret. Yeah, Riptide though, it, smartly. I, I like that. Dude. 
he's not just trying to rush up here. You have to use this this panel right here as cover, which he's doing pretty well. Um, and he's been able to get a kill on Dead Walking. Let's see if Infobiter can uh, help him out. Maybe get uh, get some coverage in. Again, great use of cover here. And there's the revive. And we should see a pretty decent advancement of the escort. Riptide pushing way up. I love this. We need to see just a little bit more. Maybe a, a mine right here to, to make this um, a no-no advancement point. Basically draw the line in the sand. Razzle's going to poke out, see if he can take down some guys from afar with that minigun. And uh, Infant Fighter also going for long range with a sniper rifle. And if you notice, they get very quiet on TeamSpeak lately. I'm wondering if they're using invoice, in-game uh, VoIP right now. Could be. Could be. What the hell? <laughs> A few people are still using it. Or not. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, Razzle is over on the side stairs actually holding them to the back from trying to get around that side. Oh, very nice. Pretty fine job with it. Oh, okay, yeah. I, I see, I see there. I actually missed that. Uh, looks like cheese spread will be able to put him down. Um, but yeah, this is actually a great flanking route. If you come up here and you can usually get uh, several security with their eyes focused entirely on this objective. They're all focused down here. Uh, maybe actually a lot of my kills come up exactly where Ender Wigan is standing. Because look at this, you can you can peek around this corner right here. And oh, this guy's dead, that guy's dead, that guy's dead. Yeah, I mean you can get so many kills. That being said, info biter. In a, in a uh, actually quite precarious position, I'm surprised he hasn't been killed yet. Because security can drop in on uh, him. The horse guy is I working on it. I, oh, no, actually, he's facing the other direction. No, actually, yeah, look at that. Warhammer and Riptide both have come up here and, uh, and oh. taken that spot. Uh -huh. Sorry. Horse guy will probably get double teamed here. There, down he goes. So we should see Nechi getting a little bit of a waltz up the ramp. A little bit of damage done on him. Now he's down, so pretty decent. Uh, I think that was dead walking getting the kill. He went down to Razzle. Here comes Razzle with a minigun. Friendly fire is on, so they need to be careful with their shots. They can't just spray into an entire crowd, which is can, you know, that, that can ruin anyone's day. I think what I hate the most is when people knock me over with uh, friendly fire on. They don't realize that... One Sliding knocks everyone over. It's it's really annoying. You get that one asshole that slides out of the spawn and he knocks over half the team. Especially on like uh, fucking Container City where you got to get there as resistance. Is that asshole's name Retsy? <laughs> no, no, I, I don't think you've done it. Oh, I have. Just maybe not. Oh, it's not not with me. Well, you shouldn't out no. yourself like that. You know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, Nancy has been, been stopped in one of the tough spots. Now, in my mind, uh, just tactically, leave Nancy there. Don't even worry about him. He's not your priority. Priority right now is uh, for this resistance. Or, yeah, yeah, excuse me. For the resistance to try to take up sniping points. We're seeing a, a few of them. Ooh, hang on. Is, is your brink? There we go. I had a little, quite a bit of a stutter there. Yeah, mine's been doing that as well. Okay. Yeah, just making sure my stuff's still working. I guess it is. Don't know what happened there. Okay. Um, that being said, you know, this is really nice, but I still would like to see some more flanking. Uh, I'm kind of surprised Warhammer and Fur Turkey are still alive, to be honest. Um, but I would love to see some back route action, um, preferably up these stairs around here and what you can what you can do from this position which you can't do very well from uh, from the sniper posts keep running out is uh, is you can stop the security from even getting past this point right here and uh, if you lock them into fighting for cover um, or if you rip tight you just run straight up in, in their faces yeah that works too <laughs> but um, yeah they, they're actually about to enter the hardest part of the map which is this kind of s-shaped hallway Zigzag hallway, if you will. We should be seeing engineers get stuff up. Yeah, sadly, we need to see. Let's see what kind of mines we got nice here. She spread, laying down something. Shit. I hope. Thank you. 
thinking about uh, it. No. Yeah. Is he waiting for a pit? There it is. He, go he goes with the turret. I. This is an obvious turret placement. I don't know how I feel about it. He does have a mine in the back. I just saw. Um, honestly, in my humble opinion, you place the mine first, and you and you place it right in front of Netiev, so that when they toss him a revive. Uh, he hits it, or the guy reviving maybe even hits it. Turret will take down Nechiev and the guy reviving. Um, and then, like, literally, you just keep placing your mind as close to Nechiev as possible. Because this is where, as uh, security, you want to force the resistance to inch worm Nechiev. You want absolutely a zero uh, chance for him to get up to any sort of a real walking pace. Uh, because this is your last attempt. You got eight minutes left on the clock. That's a long time to hold. Yeah, actually, I think if I was going to do a turret, I would just place one ahead of time uh, in the corner where the barrier is outside. Because um, it's out of reach of bouncing mm -hmm. grenades. Well, I, and I, I, yeah, I throw, a, tur or throw a, a mine down somewhere in between. Stop. Well, the, the problem I have is that that's all kind of in the path that Resistance is already trying to fight. So they're going to see it, they're going to take it out, one nade, and it's done. Uh, I would maybe prefer putting it, um, like, over uh, tucked in... Th there's like a... I'm trying to think of how to describe this without seeing it, but I guess those on the stream will see it. Uh, as the security spawn, if they come out into this parking lot, you make a right, and then a right again, there's this little pocket of cover. Put a turret in there that's facing the top of the ramp. And um, the reason why is it's a pretty far grenade toss, okay? It's not necessarily the direction that resistance is going to be looking in um, as they as they round the corner. So there's a good chance you're going you're to get some pot shots um, without just an instant nade toss on it. So, um, again, it, turrets are really about hindrance and nuisance. And if it's, like, right in the path, I haven't found them to be terribly effective. Because most, most players have at least one pip ready for a nade. Cheese spread, I think, made the wrong decision there. He went straight to try to kill Nechiev. Um, while that's somewhat useful, uh, killing the medic should be a far higher priority. Simply because right now Pocket's opponent is able to revive. Now he can support Razzle as they press up. And it's just a matter of time before they clear this and they get a revive on Netshu. Looks like Pony is actually out of pips, though. Otherwise, I think he would have been helping and supporting this heavy just a little bit more. Here comes Fro Turkey trying to get in. And a dead walking, sliding into his death, actually. Friendly fire is on, so I think that Molotov actually uh, hurt more than it helped in some cases. Netshu is up, and this is what I was uh, expecting. Again, Medic needs to be your highest priority um, unless you know, for example, that the Medic is out of pips. Which, you know, you, you, can, you can figure and factor that. I mean, it's, uh, it's quite possible to, to kind of tell that just based on how they're playing. So, uh, we're about to enter the sort of the highway of depth for Nechiev. And so far, the fact that he's down and not been able to move is uh, pretty fortuitous for the security team. They have another 5 minutes and 40, uh, 38 seconds to hold. Infobiter in a... He needs to watch. I, I'm surprised he's not getting sniped here. Uh, so I got Nechiev into the tunnel. Yep. Holly. Uh, Slava is asking if he can be added to the show cap. Do we call? <laughs> sure. I'll bring him in. Here comes a mine. And yes, we are moving into the little area. Let's see if we can uh, ask him in on the call. Where are you at, dude? Sparks come out. No problem. There we go. All right. Let's see if we get his uh, answering machine. <laughs> <laughs> he did ask 15 minutes ago, I just didn't see it. Yeah, it's all good. We'll probably get his answering machine. Now, here is... Um, this is quite, quite a difficult uh, position for resistance to push through. Um, as, I guess, easy as the opening objective tends to be for resistance, when you have to escort this guy in pretty much a, a severe lack of cover um, and how slow he goes, I mean, you really need to look for these large windows of, of downtime in order to get him moving. So, um, have not seen that just yet. Looks like Resistance uh, is in the middle of a, a respawn. You can see all the names showing up here. Warhammer, though, I like that he's been uh, finding some great sniping spots. and. Really using his range to his advantage. A lot of snipers oh, they get. Oh, my game locked up on me again. What's that? Oh, my game locked up on me. 
Yeah, I, I had one, that, but it was a very short. So maybe it's a, something to do with his server. I'm not. I'm not sure. Because uh, I haven't experienced that before today, to be honest. Warhammer, though, taking it. This is a great position. He's got to watch his flanks, though. Um. What? All right, I'm literally bringing up the, the thing. Warhammer is on resistance. Horse guy is on security. And I don't have any understanding why that security guy, horse guy, didn't just straight up kill him. That, that makes no sense to me. Anyway, maybe he was in disguise or something. No. Sh shouldn't it be? No, he, he's up there. So I don't know. I don't know what that was about. So Most as the game is going on, I decided from the beginning to take some screenshots. I'm uploading them right now, so I will have them not on IRC right now, but I will have a link. Or if you can find my Steam profile, which is Retsy, RT, or ETS. Why is that right? Yep. Uh, <laughs> they, are, they are being uploaded publicly, publicly to my Steam account for your viewing pleasure. Uh -huh. I, I don't mean to laugh. I'm sorry, though. This is kind of funny. Um, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hi, my name is Bob. B. Ah, oh, crap. You B. <laughs> Can't get you guys anymore. I know there's a vowel in there. Oh, I never yeah. claimed I was smart. <laughs> you are smart. Don't worry about it. Okay, so Infobiter again. You know, I, I need to give some props to this guy because he's uh, picking some unorthodox angles and whatnot in order to really battle the security. Um, Getting the security off of this perch, uh, if you've got really decent security snipers, they can just poke out here and, and just keep sniping. So uh, I, I like that you know he's, he's pressing all the way up, trying to get that damage, get the distraction in. That being said, we still have uh, Nechiev pretty much stopped in his tracks. And he's uh, keep back three meters. He's at that line right there. Not quite into the gauntlet, the, the final gauntlet for the resistance. They've got to get... Um, their focus should not be on revives on Netsia. That should happen after they've cleared out most of the security. They don't need to kill everyone, but they need to kill at least the medics. Uh, and then just be working on cleanup before they start reviving and getting a move on this objective. So, yeah. That's, in my opinion, look at that. We have a Lazarus grenade completely wasted. That's something that could be used uh, to keep the team in play. Uh, I, I very much disagree with that. Um, Infobiter, again. As resistance, getting his snipe on. Whoever said you couldn't snipe in the break? <laughs> it's happening right before your very eyes. Yeah. Oh. I think. Oh, we, we do have a revive on Nenshi. Let me see if I can hop back out there. Yeah, he's revived but not moving. Resistance needs to basically now expose themselves. Oh, there, here comes Muck Muck. Somehow not able to kill hands. That's, that's kind of scary. There we go. Dead wing. Dead walking. This is done. Oh, self revive. <laughs> tries to knock him down. Actually ends up knocking himself down somehow. And finally, there's Wait, a there's a nade there as well. And we got medics yeah, I don't giving know sweet sweet love. Supplies and health to each other. So, 25 uh, well, we seconds left on this clock. Nets yeah, are so like close and yet it. so far. If only the foul <laughs> line here <laughs> was its destination. Like Sadly, it will not be. Uh, let's see if we get a hero hold mode and overtime revive. This is actually one of the most tense things about this map. I don't know if you ever yeah, played a Red Sea well. where you get into a um, overtime situation. Yep. But the way it works is if he goes down, he's done. And you, you ha basically you have to keep him moving at all times and uh, oh. and in motion. And it's ridiculous. I love it. But. Um, Looks like security yeah. barely is able to hold off the resistance, so I feel like considering this yeah, security tower, that's actually pretty decent in balance. Are pretty difficult. Uh, since we got that pretty... was not that was not bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's pretty funny lot. if you can do the. One thing I would actually like to see is a maybe a speed buff on I the objective. The objectives. Mm -hmm. For these long ones. Medic classes. Yeah. Correctly. And I'm kind of hoping actually, we get past the first fast, objective. What's that? Yep, like yeah, that, that was actually going to say the same server. thing. I, I hope <laughs> that it, it goes to at least two, but to the end. Because it's actually, I really like this map when we get past the first objective. When you get pushed back to the spawn, it's not so fun. Yeah. That being said, we are live and we have security doing a very fast push. Let's see, now we do have adrenaline in play, so it's quite possible 
Cheese spread getting up there. And let's see, where's his medic? Where's his medic? Oh! What the fuck? Where are the medics, man? <laughs> Hands hey, is yeah, back in spawn. Not, so. And Response. he is literally the only medic. So. Uh. GG? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Yes, uh, we, we had Slava join at one point. Yeah, I did hear him. Or you, he you, with the Slava, you can hop in the game, dude, because they are down by one, according to my scoreboard. Need an engineer. Oh, that warms my heart to did hear. Play? We need an engineer. Because, again, I'm a Quake nerd still. Bot's coming around. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, the bot is coming around, but still no plan to escape now. You know... I have to say, one thing I have seen pretty successful in um, Apocalypse in, mind. Yeah, I can use range in pub charge. play is using this bot for cover. So, That's you know, th that, is, that is another another strategy that, that can be employed. Let's see, is, is there medic on the move yet? Main is spots at the gate, no plant just yet. Let's see. Um, hands is still the medic, and he's apparently getting XP, so he's, he's on the battlefield somewhere. Yeah, here he is. But he's, he's down and out. So, still no plant. Now, the flip side to using this bot for cover is guess what the resistance gets to do right now. Since they've got the clear, Riptide will now use the bot as cover. And it'll be very difficult to break this. Very difficult indeed. Now, one thing I, I do like as far as strategies that work really, 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 really well. Every motherfucker except for one medic goes soldier. It's your objective class. Yep. You get nades, flashbangs, and molotovs. Uh, in this case, it would be times, you know, five plus one medic. And I guarantee you, you will break out of the spawn. I guarantee you. Where's the medic? No medic. Oh, they do get the plant down oh, they though. Have plant? Yeah. Oh man, hero hold mode. Let's see. And here's the medic to get one revive up. Not gonna be good enough. Info biter though, tossing his Molly to try it. By the way, Molly is uh, thanks to you. Betsy, I don't know if, if you've uh, if you noticed <laughs> that. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. All right. <laughs> I, I I heard you or read that you referred to it that way, and so I just started calling them Mollies. So, <laughs> uh, courtesy of Left 4 Dead 2, actually. Ah, uh, okay. I don't know where I learned it, but I got it. Gotcha. So there was one attempt at disarm. Can you know, disarm someone twice in the same life or something? It was failed. Yep, so actually, we, yeah, we do get past this first objective. Very nice, Yay. and the bot is so up and uh, the at life. the gate, so it just needs to get in, you know, a little bit of proximity love cheese spread making that happen. Ooh. Got to got to crush the bot. Get it moving. Whatever the fuck it's called in this game. Fuck now, off. one thing I do love Strong is, uh, have you stood underneath the bot as it drops from the buff. crane? No. no. It's not buff. Yeah, it, it'll crush you. It's kind of cool. So oh, it, it, okay. It, All right, it's I'm it's my new that. it's my new way so to no, slash except kill. Except I take damage. Sure. <laughs> and, but it's all Switch up my my classes. Because I found that sadly most people. Most engineers are unable to complete this next objective, so I have to do it. And then I switch back to being a medic, because that's what I love They're to do. Spawn. That being yeah, said, actually... wow, the bot is rolling through here. Finally going to get disabled. Maybe it's got a little sliver on it. It's a little sliver. The, but security is absolutely, absolutely rolling through this right now. Finally it's disabled. But pretty massive mistakes, I would say, for the resistance. Yeah, I have to agree. And actually, uh, I'm I'm really surprised that they didn't completely disable the bot while they were using it for cover. Yes. So yes. I'd exactly. I sit there and heal it while I'm doing my thing because <laughs> I don't yeah. want them to to well. get up, you know, <laughs> get the, the get the gate. Yeah, now, you know. yeah. So here here's what I see missing: resistance, no turrets. They have one engineer, three yeah, medics. One operative. They are missing a soldier. Um, they basically need two medics, a soldier, and and one engineer at the very least. And you know, if you want to play operative, that's fine. But they need to be doing some really amazing shit. Um, because I mean, I mean, look at like Muck Muck. 
and Apocalypse Pony, as soon as they go down, they're done. You know, where's at least the one engineer laying down a mine? Oh, nice flanking here. Let's see, who is this? Burra Burra. Very nice, getting a pair of kills on both Ender Wigan and Muck Muck. Using height advantage and his uh, rolls of fat in order to exact <laughs> domination. So yeah, really nice setup here by Burr. And let's see if that can afford a repair. Indeed it does slightly. We have a slight repair, maybe 30% now on this bot. And actually EMP nades being used. Okay, you know, that is something I can definitely really enjoy about having an operative on resistance. That is really cool. Okay, so again, I think this, they're missing a soldier. They need to have one of those medics to a soldier. And I think they'd be a little bit stronger. They need to have their engineer actually using their abilities. Um, because here we've seen security. They're going to be able to get a repair on it right now. And actually, it's security setting up turrets. It's security setting up mines. That should not be the case. And 2x drink TV. Uh, I don't know what he's saying. Where? Uh, just in game chat. He said it's done 2x. Not really sure what he was referring to. But the bot is on the move. That's the important thing. And it looks like EMP, EMP, yeah. the bot doesn't stop it from rolling. Huh. So what what does EMP the bot do? I wonder. I'm not sure. Give it a one second countdown for no reason apparently. Oh, <laughs> you said it's done if I die. <laughs> uh, slows repair. Slows repair. Okay. okay. Thanks okay. for Tide. Put your bad uh, guy spotted. Seems like we have a bunch of cheaters listening in on the broadcast. <laughs> no, it's all good. Uh, this is just for fun. I don't give a fuck. Um. Really nice though. Again, coverage info biter. Getting the snipes in. And clearing the way for the spot. This is pretty much at the crane. Um, yeah, again, I, 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 just, I dislike that we're not seeing um, resistance make full use of their engineer. So dead walking needs to uh, get dead set on setting down his mines and turrets. We Getting have. Deadly. Yes, horse guy and cheese spread already on this objective. This one actually repairs pretty quickly, given that it's like one in eight objectives that makes sense. It should be pretty fast. And that's not an over-exaggeration at all. By the way, can I just point out? Three engineers on this thing, and no one's even shot them. So, Infobiter, wait, really? Wow, we had four engineers in play there. Infobiter providing cover, because he's a badass. Now, I'm going to try to stay underneath this thing as the spectator and just see what happens. I don't know if I will crash the server. But I'm willing to find out. Anyone? Oh no! Oh uh, fuck! Yeah, I'm, I, 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 I just I hit a sticky bomb. I gotta go up in the air and detonate <laughs> it. Oh, splash damage! Me love you, long hey, time. Hey guys, uh, can you hear me now? Yes. Yes. Oh, no. oh it went through me. Crashed. What's up, Slava? Uh, oh, oh, hold on. Awesome. You know what? That's gonna be like a new theme song for Bring TV. Yep. I'm kidding. That was totally planned. ATI drivers. Yeah, it really wasn't, but that's okay. Damn, an ATI car is just like. Um. That being said, the bot is in in place. No repair on it yet. Completely disabled. Yeah. So this is another really good hold point for. Multiple bandits spotted. For the resistance, because quite frankly. You can use bot as cover. You have the uh, spawn point that lets out right into a, a great um, height advantage position along with uh, some cover. So you can snipe pretty effectively. You have a very Multiple small window of fire. God damn, that's loud. You have a very small window of fire um, for the security to shoot up at you uh, from, from this ledge. So really, you know, you can use this to uh, maximum potential. And, uh, let's see what else. I don't know, but yeah, again, this is a really good hold point. Multiple enemies spotted! And I really need that asshole to stop yelling that there are multiple enemies spotted, because I don't need to know that. <laughs> Seriously. Shut the fuck up. Okay, so the bot's repaired. Indeed. And... She's right down. Infobiter emptying a clip. 
does take on Dead Walker. And, you know, I don't know if you've heard this, but multiple enemies have been spotted. I, I heard. I wasn't aware of that. I, I just, I wasn't sure about that, but now I am. Yeah. I wonder if there's ever just a few enemies spotted. Yeah. <laughs> One, maybe two enemies spotted. Possibly. I'm outside stairs. Offense is going upside stairs. Oh, we got, we're actually getting some no, communication over team speak. Very changed. nice. We're not going there anymore. <laughs> of course, hilariously, yeah, both, both teams are in this team speak, so might not want to use that they as are, your avenue of communication. The there are yeah, separate have... channels, though. Yeah, this thing is very well organized. <laughs> so, anyway, uh, the bot is currently stopped. Oh, but... luck, my love you. And there should be a mine here. Let's see if there is one. No. Um, the side stairs have been built, though. So there really should definitely be a mine there to at least give a warning that security is going to be using that particular pathway. Kind of dismayed that, that it's not up. Multiple enemies spawned! Yeah, let's see if, uh, see if Andrew Wigan can hold things down. Resistance uh, also getting command post, dead walking, getting it done. Horse guy will go down to. This is a great spot here, Riptide. Um, a lot of bad guys on the security do not focus on this particular, um, I guess, crow's nest, if you will, that Riptide's up up in. Because you can you can get so many kills again. Their attention is not there. Here comes Cheese Spread trying to use the side stairs. And Wigan has spotted him though. I, I have to actually compliment Ender Wiggins on his character yeah. creation. Yeah. Yeah. Very. I've lived on the ocean for a long time. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I like that. I like that. Yeah, I need to do a little showcase of all my characters. I think I'm up to five or six level twenties at this point. All right. Show I'm off. lazy. Still using the same one. Well, you don't need more than one if you really enjoy a certain class, but. I like having the flexibility. My my hybrid medic engineer is getting a lot of love. We got the bottle on the move. Security is uh, trying to inch this bad boy around the corner. Looks like Dead Walking though is emptying his clips. Almost has it down. And this nade will do it. So, there we go. It's a pretty decent hold so far. 11 minutes remaining. Again, you get a lot of time on objective-based... Uh, game mode in order to get this objective done so plus the the build objective was done quite quickly I'm gonna watch Infobiter he's getting realized oh and I'm so glad that I'm not the one that, that picked up the thing on his shoulder and look at that the teammate helping him out in order to remove the very nasty sticky nade that being said though I thought was pointing putting him down so um, yeah just a reminder because I, I like to say this every broadcast but anyone on your team can remove a sticky nade don't be that asshole okay. that does not remove it Thinking that only engineers can. That happens sometimes to me in this game. Just saying. Just saying. It's so, alright, no, they're pretty hard. Yeah, I just like looked right at okay, you. Okay, horse guy, I think, is going to try another repair. Yeah, Riptide's in a pretty good position to cover them. He likes to get flanking with, with where he's at. He's been spotted though. It looks like hands will put him down. See if I can find it. It's like Hands is actually clearing uh, what is this uh, barricade. I think. Yeah. There we go. So partial repair, about fifty percent. Horse guy is trying to sneak around. I think dead walking is probably gonna Oh no. Nope. No, dead walking is dead lying. So <laughs> Horse guy has done it, but can he, can he get through here? He's about to hit a bit of a gauntlet. I like that he's using cover, not poking out too much. He's got to be very careful about nades. And Burb. Of course, these two are listening to the cast, so they went and found him. Took him out. Yeah. Um, <laughs> stop listening to the cast, guys. Turn it off, please. Thank you. <laughs> don't don't be lame. Sorry, dude. <laughs> Scared. Security. Yeah, I need to join security, help them out. Yeah, yeah, that, that's... Yeah, yeah, it's, definitely do that, please. 
Yeah, I just realized it, it was five on six. Guys, this is open to, to anyone, although I guess Slava is taking up the last slot. Yeah, play, Slava, play. Yeah, hold on. It's not let me join. Oh, I believe because he's in spectator mode, uh, he will not be able to join for eight minutes and 30 I'll seconds. Five yourself. Holy oh, shit. Is this huh? true? What do you mean? Wait on uh, the fucking thing. I don't know if it's the game mode or server settings, but when you're spec in spec mode, once the game starts, you cannot join a team. Oh, so it's like spec lock kind of thing? Yeah. Tells you you uh, can't switch for 8 minutes, and in this case, 10 seconds. So, yeah. Gotcha. Gotcha. <laughs> well, well, Slava, Slava, just reconnect. Sucks. Just connect, yeah, reconnect. Yeah. Simple, simple fix for simple people. Don't charge. Multiple enemy spotted! So it looks like they've been pushed right back to the bridge now. I'm not sure if somebody is going to be smart enough to take the alternate route or not, but... Yeah, I'm going to watch Burra here. Big, fat man of jamma. I'm sorry, but I, you know, I like it that, um, quite frankly, um, fat kids get love too in this game. Uh, that's kind of cool. How'd the game go? How's it going? Um, so the stairs are down. Awesome. Not, not doing yeah. anything. Yeah, Burrow definitely will not be able to do the wall game. hop. Or not to ask, which means to ask. Backing on those kind of bounds. Oh, he's not in here. So. Not yet, at least. So, we do have finally a build on the side stairs, but so it'll be pretty easily covered by the resistance. In fact, Wigan is uh, checking it out now. I have to say, I have to be, you have to be very careful about Vancouver like a cool um, town, though. trying to peek out over the damn stairs. Though. Two side stairs. <laughs> I, <laughs> yep. I, I tried that once and it, it did not turn out well. Decent nade. We'll knock down both. Here comes Dead Walking with Adrenaline. And he will put down Slava, I believe, and Hand. So very nice. Cheese spread that will finally get his revenge. Uh, horse guy. Medtastic. Let's see if this pans out. No, we got Burra, big bad Burra, coming up the stairs. Coming down the stairs, I should say. Very weird nade toss. That actually bounced back and kind of weird. Nice use of the operative uh, contracts, though. G spread just runs right through him because he's the boss. And we got a repair. So let's see if the uh, yep. Slava ingredient is enough. To get this thing moving and get it done. Five, Damn straight wow. it is. Five fifty on there. We're just kind of fucking five fifty on there. Slava, are you in there? Team speak. Uh, I'm muted. Okay. Well, then you should probably I can get some ammo pop out of the call, course, noob sauce. Well, I don't know. They can hear him anyway. Hey, watch behind. They're cheating. <laughs> you have a point there. I, I don't. I don't want to be promoting <laughs> said cheating. It's all good. Now, Lava, see, get out. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> but that's what I'm trying One to say. I'm on a roll. Hold on. I will get out. Yeah, yeah. When you die, dude, don't don't worry about yeah. it. Okay. And he's dead. And oh. if you can self-revive, please play. Don't worry about it. It's not that big of a deal. Did you know that the Carb 9 comes with a dildo bayonet? A dildo bayonet. <laughs> you can shove it right up your say? ass. <laughs> you may want to share what you just said there, Grease, with the, the public that are listening, because now you just sound crazy. I, I did not I say that. That was someone on TeamSpeak, yeah. Oh, oh okay. Sorry. Multiple enemies yeah, spotted! I, I, I just flipped mine over so I can actually see who's turret. talking. Yeah. One at command post. I think it was Fox Fox. Yo. <laughs> There's a turret down in the, game, in the middle. But... Yeah. Vancouver lost. What the hey? Are they talking about hockey? Yeah, they are. Okay. Please focus, focus on the game, game gentlemen. gentlemen. <laughs> Rizzy gets all echoey whenever yes, he talks in the team speak and on Skype. It's kind of cool. All right. So, the bot, while needing no repair, has been stopped at its tracks. Empty those clips, boys. Yeah, toss that nade on that. Guy. Oh, there he is. Okay. Hey, there's, there's the big burly man back there. <laughs> Multiple 
Target spotted. So, sadly, oh, action is not happening on the objective. It seems like resistance is uh, taking that over. And it looks like got a little bit of play around. Yeah, a little, little bit of play around the the barricade. Put your bad guy spotted. But it's just mostly a turret. Here comes security. Um, there are many ways to this particular area of the map, though. So, I'd like to see security put those together. Yeah, Start I'm watching, just watching all the different ways and not seeing it happen. So the bot's completely disabled. Uh, three minutes remaining. I yeah. need some skills. Here we go. We got command post coverage. Multiple enemy spotted. Now let's see if they'll they'll make use of it. Skills for kills. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and sure Enderbergen continues to cover. We're probably about to flank. Get stopped in his tracks. But that that gig is up, so. Or is it the jig is up? I never know. How, how does that go? I'm really not sure. I know I know um I prefer the cats out of the bag. The well that but see, but then then you can't sing along because what was it the renegade? <laughs> You know what I'm talking? I, I don't know. You're old enough to know no. that song. I, I'm old enough to know the song, but it's, it's my husband that answers those kind of okay, questions. Oh, he's having this fucking little. <laughs> gotcha, gotcha. Place. All right, Burra Burra, um, Burra Burra Burra. What, what the fuck is that name anyway? Burly boy. Burra. Yeah. Burly yeah. hey, yeah. boy. Yes. So, I think the objective is all but forgotten. Point. Yes, 150 on the clock, and we are in a bit of trouble. That being said, if they are able to get it to its uh, final resting place where it cuts open the door, then we should we should see an extension of time. But that needs to happen pretty damn quickly. Yeah. So, you know, actually, you know, pretty, pretty even in that we saw... We saw um, Multiple you know, enemies nearly a cap on security tower. Nearly a cap on on this map. Oh, I just crashed. And actually, surprisingly enough, uh, security not doing as well as I I thought they would. So. Yeah, he is place. making his way around. He's put a couple of mines so by sense. their uh, with their you know computer doodad thing with jigs. The, the command post. Multiple enemies spotted. Thank you. Yeah, that's one. Yeah, the computer doodad thing with jig. Yeah. Is the official name, but yes, around here we shorten it to command post. No, I think there's. Uh, he he actually spots. didn't didn't okay, push his way around and repair the bot though. So right, crazy. which is kind of more important. They so were invited tonight. Basically, he was playing the role of a bot, uh, uh, yeah. uh, yeah. which anyway. focuses on recovering the command post. That's lava. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Slava's getting like some hate. Know, like to know that Slava's as well. getting some hate, man. <laughs> People would like to know who the fuck you are. Is it audio uh, video? I know what he's not. He is not yeah, an engineer. Uh, right now, <laughs> <laughs> Outer space, nice. man. No, For eternity. eternity. Oh, the one here where we're random people play prank. Multiple Alright, guys, spotted. five seconds are gonna wind down Container City. For a jerk, you're getting repair, though. Let's see if this is counted as overtime. They can or can't hear our vent. No. Nope. Counted as moral victory for, for Turkey. Safe and security won't dare steal from us again. A win so for Turkey everywhere. For freedom today. Indeed. I don't think so. Oh, no, you could just all chat, all chat it, and she'll see it. Your mom, your mom's in the brink. I can say hi to your mom for you, if you like. Oh. <laughs> That's pretty impressive. Was that a burn or what? <laughs> Maybe. Why is my mom with you? It's yeah, way past her bedtime. Your sure. mom's a special education teacher. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I got some shit talking going on. Best overall, Apocalypse Pony bringing uh, down a, a, a little over 10,000, which is pretty impressive. Oh, yeah. That was two spots. Uh, best two soldier, Burra. Best medic, Apocalypse again, engineer, walking, dead man. And we have <laughs> best operative, Riptide. Most kills, Riptide sums it up again. Grub? Seems like he's gotten best Grub? kills in like three maps in a row. It's pretty, pretty crazy. 
So if you were watching and you were like, holy crap, I want to play in this, then head on over to the uh, Splash Damage forums, look for the North American yeah, PC Community just Game just Night like thread. There in Sorry, there, in the very first post, you will find all really. the info you need the fuck is the point of fire in order to uh, check out the, the good times. Team chat. Anything can quickly identify the, just the chat. <laughs> Uh, team chat, but also it uh, purples your uh, fire team members, yeah, so yeah, you can sure. quickly yeah. identify them. People have names anyway. I mean, it's not like. Yeah, but you can quickly identify them. Pretty. Quickly we we got some guys that are asking what are the uses of fire teams. I'm gonna take it a step further. <laughs> no, 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 fire teams no, are about I'm coordinating done, with like, a, a subset. A <laughs> subset of your uh, your team. We're talking about bring players here, so that you can focus on. You know, uh, completing certain objectives in a very efficient manner. Right, so, for example, if I'm playing with Slava, oh, it's I, okay, I never invite him to my fire team because he's a noob. <laughs> and here I thought it was because, you know, it's a pretty color. No, I, I was actually just seeing if he's still listening. Um, <laughs> I don't think he is. <laughs> yeah. But anyway. Um, yeah. So fire teams are a great way to, to kind of, you know, break off your team into subsets so that they can Shit. focus on doing things well. Um, the nice thing is, yeah, you get a nice little color coding of the name so you can There's see your, your right fire team side. partner uh, really left. clearly in a crowd. Um, further, hey, there, Morgan, how much you like um, you in the on this map, face. it's actually really important because I have found like some of the most effective ways is um, trying to take really the, the, the center of the map, that, yeah. but you need distractions on the outside of the map. You need to time that up really well, and uh, that's very hard to do unless you have two distinct teams that are very clear about what they're doing and, and how they're going to do it. And they really have two separate roles and they need to time everything well. So, you know, if you're not um, coordinating, you just ain't going to win here. So, Muck Muck running off into the sunset. How are you doing, more? How far is he going to go? <laughs> that way? Okay. Uh, well, if you go there, it'll be good for me. Uh, he looks like he was just waiting okay. for his health to reset. Coming back with his team. Very huge push. About to happen. Coming in left. Apparently on the left. <laughs> but they didn't actually press in. Hmm. No. Oh, nice. Except for Slava, who did not get the memo. He's going up against Burra. And gets hit in the face. Thank God. And he's down. Yeah. And he was about to run into a mine anyway, so we'll just call that out. Because no, it's six on four. Oh. Don't oh. shoot seriously? Yeah. Lol teams. 6 and V4. I even switched. I'll switch to your fucking Here, team. Sweet. Oh, I, was gonna switch. I was going to, but. Is there team damage <laughs> on right now? What was that? There you go. Alright. Is right. there team damage? Yeah. And there are when you're too Okay, they seem to figure it out. The there we go. Thank you, hands. Or Hansi, <laughs> For Turkey or... does not know what's going on anymore. <laughs> I think I think it's okay. <laughs> well, he has several months before he needs to worry about anyone, you know, bothering him. So. It's true. He doesn't. He doesn't need to know what's going on quite yet. Yeah. That being said, pressing up really far into security spawn, pretty much at their own MG, Ender Wigan and Hans about to press in. And oh. And so we're going left too. Planting! And we have at least a hack box down. Oh. Fur Turkey just tears box him box apart though. He does there. have that uh, part yeah. managed, yeah. And he, the box is gone. Yeah. Thunder <laughs> Okay, so it looks like Cheese Spread has covered the nice shot. next attempt fairly well. Hey, does anyone on the red team have a level up engineer? <laughs> nope. We got one covert, two medics, and two soldiers. Oh wow! Yeah, uh, resistance a has a really soldier, weird layout. At least in my view. Why do they not have I an mean, engineer? Have Those weapon buffs make a huge, huge difference. That's that's actually that pretty bad. Well. You know, I just realized there's a way into that room, into the basement, without going there at all. Like, without going to the way... I was about to say, without going there, that's quite fucking, like, <laughs> metaphysical. <laughs> no, Ender, follow me. I want to show you this. Let's go. That's how winners... So I'm going to go and see what they're talking about yeah, on TeamSpeak. Uh, uh, I'm curious. Box, yeah. 
without actually going there, they will go Another there. Great cliche. Without <laughs> actually going. Yes. To the basement. Good men. I can't even find them. Yeah, I'm. I, I'm on them. Okay, Speed I'm just gonna pop back on the objective for a second. How, how did they not know about this? I was tired. I'm not sure. This is like. I thought everyone would have known that you could go there without actually going the there. Right. Yeah. But. Okay. Okay. Good. Good to know. Good to know. Map exploration. It wins games. Like seriously, there, there's nice little commands. Um, you can disable bots and just run around maps empty. Nice shot of war. It's very handy. That being said, they did not bring a medic with them, and they are down. D O N, D O N down. I yeah. Basically, uh. Well, yeah. Well, because I I, I like I like saying it's sort of a nice little Scottish name. The Dune, but uh, <laughs> the Dune, and so that, that sounds a bit more like the O N. I guess it's more D U N, but that might confuse people even further. So. In their space, I call you a noob right now, but you know. Eh, I am a noob. So, Burra, who was kind of holding everyone back at the door upstairs, is down. Horse guy is not going to revive him. Yeah, oh, maybe because, no because... I, I guess he didn't have supply. But still, it, it, it almost seems mean, because he's just laying there and like... Horse you know, guy's running around, and ha ha! Info biter rejoins. So that, that's good, that's good. Get lit up. Alright. Let's get together. Let's get the shit together. Let's get together. Like action cards. Come together. <laughs> right now. Over okay, me. Trust me, you know that song, security. right, Redsy? Let us hack the Thank you. Okay. okay. Good lord. You're aware you. The one I'm standing right in front of. Thank you. So, still not a lot going on over at the objective. Yeah, do we even have one of those hackbox things? No, we do not. Sadly, but truly, we lack a hackbox. There's some horses and ponies and hammers and cheese like and all together. <laughs> Heavy boy, but that's about it. Mm. We were. Wow, that's a pretty one-sided obituary list there. Boom. Oh. Info biter. He's back. <laughs> yeah, he's back, and he just got three in a row, folks. Three in a row. Very solid sniping action. Oh, invisible to me right now. Although that's, that being said, Ender got in there and actually started the hack. What the fuck is this shit? She's uh, rather fur turkey. Put him down. I'm with you, Ender. If you want to give it a whirl. Yeah. Yeah. Give it a whirl. A whirl. Oh, there's Info Biter. What's he doing? He's dehacking. Like All a right. champ. Yeah. Like a champ? Yeah. I snipe, I dehack. Anti aircraft? Alcoholics Anonymous? <laughs> what? <laughs> I, I'm not too worried about it. Get the CP? I don't have time. Alright, so I'm gonna follow Slava and Ender Wigan here. See what they can put together. Final push, a minute 30. It'll be nearly impossible to get this done, but if they're hacking as time expires, it will go into overtime until the operative is dead and right. gone. So, let's see if that happens. Swallow making a press up the staircase, not checking his six. Down he goes. And uh, they were not able to take Fucking down no. the big bad Burr. So, that'll do it. With a minute five left to go, resistance. Will not be able to blow the arc into smithereens. And uh, I just caught from a screenshot that Great I took when Infobiter came back that Cheese Spread's mouse appears to be dead. Right now I can use some sound. His what? His mouse is Will dead. Mouse is yeah, dead. Yeah, oh, okay. Mouse is dead, sad face. He's still running. Not but sure if he can turn that. or shoot, but he's still participating. This actually could be really amusing to, to watch. No, he was speed, able to turn. I can't hear anything. Okay. Anymore. Must be dying. Game's fine for me. I have a turn down. Oh no, it's just, it's just, it's just me. And uh, somebody pointed out in the team speak portion that this game needs flamethrowers, and I have to agree. That would be awesome. <laughs> yeah, they were in, uh, they were in ET, weren't they? 
Uh, yes. I believe so. And of course, sadly, there's no rocket launcher. Oh, so sad. This is this is actually probably one of the very first games I've played in the last decade that does not have a rocket launcher. I'm not sure what to say or think about that. Small map, complete doors, plus rocket launcher equals fail. I don't know. That's Retsy math. I, I think sometimes really failure is That's an option. Pro tip of the day. It is an option, and sometimes it, it's way. actually not bad. Uh, sometimes you have to take out your whole team when you take out the other. Yeah, oh, yeah, you know, it's it's mutual destruction. It's good times. Best of all, horse guy. Best soldier, Burra. Best medic, horse guy again. Engineer, fur turkey. Gobble, gobble. Best operative, Ender at Wigan. Yeah, District yeah, attorney. Anyway. Next map. And uh, Burra comes up with most kills this time around. I concur. Also, telling them exactly what we're doing probably didn't help. That's why you should use in-game VoIP, boys. You know it's on. Hilarious American foreign policy subcurrent. <laughs> I, I I would actually maybe agree with that assessment. Hilarious American foreign policy subcurrent. Keep them or shuffle. Oh, is that what he said? Okay, I, I, only, yes. I only caught some of it. Yeah, say we shuffle. Oh, yes. Uh, not favorable to me, so shuffle. By the way, um, have you heard of it's the Venus Project? One team's out the whole NASA and attacker, so. thingy. No. Yeah, YouTube it. Rigged. YouTube it. Okay. It's like uh, it's that Warhammer guy's team. He's fucking new. <laughs> I'm like flying around the map. What is going on here? It put me in spectator. Yeah, I think it put me, me in too. spectator as well. Oh, there we go. Oh, sweet, you got sound. Yay. I haven't had any sound issues. No, me neither. But it always Tides makes me happy when they're screen. happy that the sound is yeah, back. He this, yeah, he's, uh, he's probably going to do pretty good. Basically, just here. Yeah. So. Yeah, he's pretty good. Muck Muck is stuck in spec with us. Well, I good players here tonight. <laughs> Hi, Muck Muck. No, Riptide's going to be really good this time. He's invisible. Yeah, he's fucking invisible. GG's my sleeve, see ya, he says. <laughs> we already have a hack going down, right I believe. Let me see if I can get oh. over to it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, I got my bearings. There we go. Alright. Oh. Through the thingy. And around the thingy. And... Alright. Thing of a bob. Yes, I made it. Wow, 50% oh, already hacked. And the uh, security is taking this no prisoners. Good side, lord. Area. Nades aplenty in the box of death. So We've got a continuation on the hack for a turkey rank for cover. He's got coverage by Burra Burra. And let's see if he can survive long enough to get this thing done. It looks like security is going to be moving on to the next objective pretty quickly. So Burra the Husky Boy is providing heavy cover, blocking the entire That's doorway. actually quite literal. <laughs> yeah. Good. Uh, oh, Infobiter joining up, doubling up. One and of the are, guys in the game just done. it's hard to take that guy seriously with the way he's dressed. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's what I would say whenever I run into someone that's shooting me in the face. You know, I would shoot back, but I'd have to yeah, take a look, you, they look at your uh, outfit. It just clashes. I mean, seriously. Things? Now, I have good news, folks. I have actually learned how to navigate this fucking map. So that I don't have to spend literally three minutes running around. Looking at stuff. <laughs> yeah. Over at the Tijin Moon. Took a long time to pick that out. <laughs> Where's where Burr going? Yeah, you can't go there. Alright. For her Burberry sack. Alright, that being said, resistance already pressing order, through. Right? Needing to set up. Looks like Ender's the only guy that got the one memo, and he's got a turret down. Back that being said, Apocalypse Pony, very quick on his feet, able to get there oh, as well, and has come from behind. I thought you guys were off forward. Before he gets taken down by, or I should Comes say, gets time. laid out by cheese spread. Hey, stop huh? telling him where I'm at. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we, we won't do that again. Um, Slava providing coverage from up top, horse guy, an additional crossfire. And, ooh, I disagree with Treespread running up there. Just use the crossfire, Luke. Jesus Christ. Um, <laughs> Warhammer in a good position oh, here. There's there's no real cover, Jutra. but uh, honestly, just sitting back here, you uh -huh. got a great overview of, of all the entrances. And your job is to call out shit. That being said, uh, Warhammer is the guy with the sniper rifle. Let me get a nice close-up on that. Yeah, that that's some sexy shit right there. You know what, you know what that sniper rifle says? It says, pwn your face. 
And uh, let, let's see if he can make it happen. There's one against Riptide. Uh oh. One below you, Warhammer. Looks like Riptide gets the kill on Info Biter. Warhammer needing to fire back here. He will go down eventually. That's awesome, Warhammer. Nope. The, uh... awesome. Oh, but he's up again. <laughs> yeah. Riptide's invin yeah, he's invisible. Oh. You guys said that, but I didn't really he's know, not even know what game, you meant. My XP's competing with my score. ping. That is funny. She spread <laughs> 600 <laughs> ping. <laughs> That's funny. Just tell him to wait the fucking game and rejoin. There we go. Warhammer taking down Apocalypse Pony from afar. Very nice shot. Can he continue the magic though? I think he needs to move around quite a bit more. Riptide, you I'm are in this bug, FYI. Watch out, someone come around back. Break down that injector. Fall back. Brothers. Alright. Back time to go find. Oh. Riptide is in the game at the moment. Spread. Damn it, guys. <laughs> Team up on the heavy. So, yeah, that, that is probably why Riptide is invisible, because he's not invisible. in the game right now. It's a ghost! Yeah. <laughs> no, we're just in our game. I'm like it. Alright, alright. Oh, Riptide. No, he is in game. Yeah, I, I, is in, but he is sent in me a game. message over his team. I guess he was reconnecting. Awesome Stanley Cup yeah, game. but he's invisible. No, I see no, his no, name floating cool. cool. around. What was so awesome about it? But I can't see him. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I see that now. That actually is pretty damn funny. Uh, Riptide. Oh. Are, oh, but well, when he gets see. killed, yeah. he's there. <laughs> yep, That's a there we nice go. sweater. That, that is pretty Long awesome, actually. Sorry, it's like right. appearing fight. on screen and <laughs> just magically delicious. Okay. Warhammer uh, needs to get his, a get his uh, sniping ass up. There he goes. So far, pretty decent hold. Jeez. That being said, um, resistance is down one. They're still holding. Two up top. I haven't seen too much of a touch on this objective by the engineers. Yeah, so did they pull yeah. a long one in the third period and then there. fucking put them back in? Yeah, it seems like everyone they is just them together completely content to keep pushing. They did, and then they fucking threw them back in, eh? Like, they pulled them for what, like 30 uh, the top seconds? There. They scored. Riptide's rejoining, by the way. Yeah, he I get some ammo, Warhammer. Sorry, I, believe it or not, I was trying to push it. It just wasn't looking at you. Still pretty quiet over by the objective. Yeah, Fur Turkey's making his way in. Be an area of effect, and not Still? a goddamn lock on. But he's quite the lone wolf here, so he should be, should be taken down. Riptide is totally invisible to me. This is awesome. I will yeah. need to disconnect. But you know what they say about Riptide? Warhammer's killed himself. I'd like to know how. Yeah, I, I, I'm just gonna put this up on the stream real quick. This is, this is kind of hilarious. Just watching a floating name. I was sandwiched. All right, I'm gonna disconnect, reconnect. Do you believe the dictionary definition Jesus of riptide? Oh, you're deadly with probably that. Probably does say something along the lines of silent One of but the deadly. Was not here. Carp Chen's number two cannon. He's deadly. cooperating. <laughs> he says Chen's been using the main. Fr and changed him to the spectator. There we go. All right. Yes. My objective finding skills are in full throttle tonight. <laughs> Info biter, he's crazy. Oh, goodness gracious me. All right, we're back. And we're cutting the safe open because that's what fur turkeys do. <laughs> and oh, there is Riptide, nope. quite visible. Yay. Info biter, fur turkeys decided to uh, run away. Give the medics. Indeed. Oh. Coming back? Oh, no. No, he's gonna hide. Can he survive though? No, alive. horse guy puts him down. Alrighty, so I don't know what the progress is, quite Her frankly. Turkey's on the ground. Horse guy killed him completely, so back to square one. Pretty much. Big bad bear is up top. Infobiter attempted a uh, turret. 
And that taken out. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, look at this. Gun. Down fire by Warhammer. Still, <laughs> still hoping that he could snipe. Guess he, you know, no luck. Oh. <laughs> mm, Pocket was pony, not. not a yeah, I really needed to check that corner before he came out in front of it. He's Don't down and out. Okay. So 513, I think that uh, resistance has got to be feeling pretty good at this point. I don't think my textures are loading correctly in my weapons. How the textures not load correctly? How is Riptide invisible? <laughs> Touche, madam. Touche. <laughs> but no, that, that's a completely client side issue. Can be fixed within 10 seconds. So, True. you know, it, it's sad that it exists, but as bugs go, it's terrible for a um, comp, you know, competitive match for sure. But once we have pause, you know, all right, just pause the game, just connect, reconnect. I mean, you saw how quickly I got back in for those that are watching the stream. It, it's quick and easy. It, it's painless. All right. That being now, said, now I, I would like to point out that there was an operative on the other team that was disguised as Riptide. So despite not being able to see his body, he somehow managed to hack it. And wear oh, pants for a little while. Well, it's, 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 uh, it, it's just particular Heavy clients that won't see it. Uh, I think some people will probably see him fine. No, and the sad thing is, like, my game is frozen again. No, they're outside. Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's, I haven't quite figured out all the nuances of the bug. That being said, security desperately needed to get in here and get a tap. Three minutes, 44 seconds left. Apocalypse Pony just. Really kind of rushing his okay. ass in here, trying to set up a turret on the side that's not going to kill anything or anyone. I Rip, I'll you. Focus I'll you on the, killing the, the, the people, dude. Come, on, dude. Come on, dude. All right. Come on, bruh. I hope he's on. Get it done, bruh. So I say you're pretty little ass over there and <laughs> oh, blow towards that safe. Pull that blow torch out of one of those ripples. Uh oh. Sticky nade. Sticky nade. Oh, it's pain. Okay, there we go. So we got some weapon buffs. That, that's happening. That's good. That's good. I see a mine in a, in a good place. I'm assuming it, right uh, it was info biters. Mm -hmm. So, uh, a tip. If there are invisible characters in the game and you happen to know who it is and you see them suddenly in the game, it's probably not them. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> That's down, I think. Oh, brutal. There's one back there. In the back area. Yeah, Ripchai is basically trying to spawn camp. Let's see if it's enough to get his team an opportunity. Oh, Watch it yep, right, and Indeed it is. Is thing. She's spread was unsuccessful at taking them out. For Turkey, got them memo a little late. Yeah, Slav is about to wreck their party though. Left side, left side. Down goes one. Does he have the gib? No! He does not no. take down the, the down fire the apocalypse fire. pony. So let's see if we can get a revive in here. Warhammer from the back though. Two minutes left to go. Can they stop this safe cracking? Ender, mine, right on the objective. I dislike that placement, to be honest. If you've got two mines, put Man, one here fuck. and one there. So that as they run up to it, they trigger them. Oh, Not wow. if they get this to stand there on the they are invincible after they arrive. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, did we get... Who, who joined this here? Spitfire in this is spooky. Ender. Cool, okay. Yep. Got, got some new new blood. Thank you. That being said, it is seven on... To your right, Warren, behind you. Okay, oh. whatever. Uh, that being said, Resistance should not have the extra. I actually see six on six. Oh. I don't see spooky. Yeah. Hmm. How come you're seeing something different than what I'm seeing? I disconnected and reconnected, maybe? No extras, even teams. Almost done. So there's only about 47 seconds left. Yeah, alright. 
So we got. That's not enough time to get the safe open. No. Well, I don't know what the progress Just is. Just off me. That's Thank true. You. There was some briefly. They have 30 seconds. And it, and it will go into overtime if they're on it. Way down. But here comes a fresh respawn wave for the resistance. I think they're going to take it. Uh, Brock with ponies on it, but not covering his hiney. Down he goes. Or not, I lost. For a turkey, 13 seconds. Gonna have to win it for the entire team right here. No, seven seconds. Some uh, ammo. Info biter, maybe. But no. Oh, oh. Nade, nades on it. Nades short. Oh, Overtime. Two, one. Overtime. Overtime of five seconds. Uh, Down they go, and there's the revive. I don't know why. And that'll do it. Oh, well very, done, very brother. close, very close. Data is yeah. wiped and useless to them. I couldn't find lamps are safe. I was right beside so you. Yeah. Pro your sound will probably come back on the next map. Or see, that's why we gotta get on a fire team so you can actually see your teammates. No, no, no. I didn't see <laughs> that's a ridiculous notion. Nope. Shoot everything that moves. Hey, I was in the cutscene. Did you see that, guys? I'm fake. <laughs> All right. So, so just, just hop over the scoreboard <laughs> and the, show. Did you have the correct gun? One, two, three, four, five, I don't know, six, I was wearing a bag in my head, that's players. all I was worried about. I was looking for the guy in the yeah. blue four, five. Is that you with the purple pants? I saw so do you see seven players now? Yeah, the skinny ass guy with the purple pants. Five. Yeah. Like, no okay. shit. Come on, I want to be the invisible dude this time. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, there are bugs that need to be I fixed. Save my dudes bugs need to be fixed. I still don't see fucking spooky. You guys still don't have a spooky. Spooky's the ninja player. Woot! I'm not fucking reset. Yeah, I see Riptide today. <laughs> I'm gonna melee kill everybody. <laughs> Strategy talk going on over in TeamSpeak that I like. Indeed. Uh, I'm going to take a Where quick break. Go? Lava, can you can you talk with Priest for a few minutes? Oh, that's all good. It's all good. good. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm turning on a fan though, so I don't okay. cry. Okay. Pretty useless medic. They're planning. Uh, much better. Wow. Hey. Holy crap, you already have this cow on the on? pillar. That is ridiculous. Um, Indeed. Yeah, today. You guys are useless. <laughs> we also have a hack on the door. Let's go over the you door. Guys, hard. You guys did kill me, just for what it's worth. You guys attacked the command post. Oh, oh, you guys seriously lost. Spooky guys could not authenticate user. Oh. It's holding off three on the command post. All right, so we do have a disarm on that charge. We won't see the thing blown so quickly, thankfully. That would be you very bad. He does. Alrighty. That being said, though, the downstairs, downstairs market door is already open and has been hacked. Horse guy. Pressing through Riptide, also pressed up. Uh, turret goes down. And resistance. I sent war. It's all over this bad boy. They just need a just soldier on, but how to get up here. Dumb the command post is, and then you're new. You nice placement it. of a turret. Yeah, they didn't even really? know what it was for. They said it, it, they said it had no benefit in the game. It yeah, will probably get some surprise kills. Yeah, that's my only strategy. That's an Where's the soldier? Here comes Ender Wigan. In the clear. Just a couple of guys is gonna walk through Caltrops, so that's gonna hurt. It's landing. No, I'm not. Yeah, that was a pretty big mistake to not have coverage by his medic. Where's the gib, though? Can he get the plant? Yeah, there we go. Now he's got the coverage. Burra coming in for the kill, along with Fur Turkey. It's Fur Turkey actually getting the kill. And, um, we do a plant. A bona fide plant this time, 32 seconds on the clock. And immediate disarm, she spread, ducking down, dodging nades. Not able to get the disarm though, he is down and gibbed. Pretty critical action at the objective. Can't info biter get it done? No, because guess what? I told you, surprise kills by this turret. Boom. It earned two, not able to stop the defuse from happening completely, but pretty decent altogether. Of course, pressing up. Market window. Oh, Setting a satchel charge. Thanks I don't know if you saw that guy. A satchel charge on the door. Thank you. So let's see if we can rush back and he detonates it. 
can't help you. That's not gonna kill them. No worries. I'm just giving super password. And yeah, you need to, you need to check guys. your six for things like turrets and riptides. Actually, it's really late for me. I'm gonna head out anyway. Really late? It's Fire only 11.37. We're gonna spook. definitely go through at least one more game. Yeah, guys. Uh, no, I watched the Stanley Cup, right? Oh, that's right. Oh, that's right. They're all into hockey or something. Good thing the Canadians won. So we got Resistance trying to press up through Escalator. It looks tomorrow. like right now the security is bearing down on that particular entrance, keeping it pretty well done. Burrett getting into it. Oh, boss is decent position. Actually drops in. So with the Cortex bomb, do I physically have to hit someone with it? No, you just, after after you die, it asks you if you want to detonate it. Yeah, you just hold it as if you were going to revive, but do the opposite, essentially. Wait, can you repeat that? Alright, so we, we do have cheese spread up here. Let's see if you can You'll survive long it. enough against Horse Guy. Horse Guy is uh, coming out of cover. I, I kind of disagree with that a little bit. Let's see if he pays for it with his life. House is a nade. Nope. Down he goes. Uh, looks like Spitfire will get the kill. We got a self revive though. Cheese spread coming up and just loading his face with, uh, well, something that wasn't quite pepper spray. And cheese spread is laid out. So, Hand's able to get the final word. Maybe. Come on, yours. Warhammer coming through. Very nice. Locking hands down. So, Spitfire join the resistance. Hands disconnects. Let's see what we got in terms of layout. Uh, layout of teams here. Run these rosters. Infobiters rejoined. Superlink has joined us. Very nice to see. We got a plant going down though. Ender Wigan. Contemplating life and all it means to plant on the objective. 4.33 on the clock. If Horse Guy can get through and provide proper coverage. Subjective oh, vote. It's under fire. Switches up position. Here come the disarms. Can he get the firepower down? Warhammer needs to turn around. And I think we might have a detonation here. There it nice. is. Yeah. All right. We're moving on to the bot escort objective. This is a mixture of bot and plant ah, objective. While escorting, you have to plant to destroy a bridge. Um, and this is not one of those things you can rush plant either. Or at least, I've never been able to. Mine's real quiet, but... That might be team speak. I'm gonna follow Sippling and see what he's gonna do in terms of his coverage of this bot. Moving through Moz now. And going up against Riptide and will be the victor. Waiting for his health to regen, I'm sure. There it is. Yep. Actually, he sticks himself with a needle. Good height advantage. We already have a plank going down. Uh oh. That's not good. 32 seconds on this clock. Already a plant. Pretty damn clear. Solid hold as well. That is never a good sign. Ouch. Ouch. I do believe security is going to be pushed back pretty solidly here. Yeah, it's cheese spread not getting anywhere. So resistance will be moving on in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Boom. That being said, the bot has yet to join us at this party. So again, I, I like the no, focus on that bridge, not necessarily on the bot. The bot's a lot easier to move up. You can use it for cover, so on and so forth. It's much easier to get the uh, repairs in on it, um, for the most part. I'm gonna hop around and see. I like as um, as security coming up and and using a little bit of height advantage here. Looks like that's not gonna be the case. Looks like this uh, Riptide's turret is what what got this guy over here, but. Yeah, you can get, look at this, I mean, look at all these shots from right here, this position, boom, 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 snipe, 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 it's good times. 
Oh man, that had to hurt. Big fat man slamming his junk into you. Oh, never good. That being said, not enough damage is being done on the bot, so proximity will keep it in play. And progressing, so security really needs to lay down the damage. We got uh, Spritfire running the op, doing the mixture of teabag plus take your take your clothes. There we go. Oh, really? Is, is he really just leveling up? Is he really just leveling up right here? It's kind of sad. Just taking the disguise and dropping it. And just turn around. <laughs> I don't know if you've ever done that as an operative. It's like pretty much the only way to actually level up if you're a complete stickler and that's all you run as operative. You get like no XP for actually helping your team. The only XP you get is from uh, killing a guy and taking his uniform. But then of course, you don't get any reward for having a uniform. And like maybe, you know, I think they should give you some like, you know, um, just some... Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like an ET. Static XP for just having an enemy's uniform Wait, on because an not being spotted because uh, like TF2. Basically, or, the XP system is begging you to lose your uniform and go like kill another guy and pick up his his uh, disguise simply because you can get 100, 125 yeah, XP like, every time you do that. Whereas every right, other operative tank, uh, ability is like seat, right? nice shit in terms yeah. of uh, gaining XP. So. Um, the operative was the one class that I literally just picked up some medic abilities and just played medic because I, I got okay. literally oh. bored with it. Um, I don't know, it, just, it didn't seem all that fun. I, I'm not, a, I'm not, but that's, the, that's my play style. I'm just not a big operative guy, to be honest. I will always be the medic style of player. That being said, Super Link, this is actually a pretty decent position. He should stay right here. Oh, though not right there. He's, he's got to use this cover. Got to duck down. You can, you can duck down. And uh, it'll be very hard to see. That being said, Riptide flanking very nicely. Hey, let's go watch Riptide for a second. There's, he's been running. That's why I like the turrets and the mines. He's been running the op all night, and he's actually hacking the the main objective right now. Huh, you learn something new. No. Because um, he's been running this uh, operative class so well. Look at this. Wow. Even Burr doesn't even notice him until it's too late. He's down. Although, that being said, Super's able to come in. And wait, what? Super kills Riptide. Riptide. And Cortexes. Angel Fighter has the hack block. Yeah. Oh, nope. Not quite gone. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Poor Sky, sporting my favorite costume of the game. To come down. <laughs> okay, Andrew Wigan though is on the objective. Let's see what the progress is. About 10-20%. Uh, this guy doesn't realize he's... No? And Riptide's so back. Oh, Andrew Wigan not checking his 9. The X gets a shot in the ear. He's down. Warhammer coming in. And able to return the favor though, Resistance has this objective once more. And I just spawned all the way back here. That kind of sucks. And I'll go third person and get up to the objective, hopefully before it's done. Still That's hacking? It. Yeah, 40%. Back in his spot again, so I don't know he's there. Yeah, it's a happy spot. Actually, he comes out and tries to flank. Does not work out for him. He wanted he's to stop that. Yeah, he wanted the hack box. Yeah, I wanted to stop that D hack, so. Uh, now, what, what, what are your thoughts about this command post over here? Where's this thing? It tells you how often I go to it, right? Can't even find um, the goddamn thing. Not following the stream, so you'll have to help me out with that one. Um, it's at Le Flow Suits and Villas, apparently. Yeah, Le Flow. Exactly <laughs> yeah. Ouch. Um, My noggin. I sadly have had teams that try to focus way too much on this, and I, I can maybe understand why, because you can set up crossfires, but I honestly have far better luck when I just make a mad dash for this objective, and just as soon as I get in this room, then I can deal with the bad guys, but up until that point... Spot, yeah, this spot here is, I just usually see a lot of dead bodies. Three of them in there now. Yeah, it's easy to take people down. I don't see it as a 
a really useful spot for subjective at all. She's trying to remove the hack box again. Indeed. They got 1240 to work with, so I think it's still quite possible. Burai, though, yeah, using great use of cover. Needs, honestly, Resistance should flank his fat ass. <laughs> Not gonna happen, though. He, he actually does a bit of the same. And a Wigan, though, getting a pair. Burra and Suplink go down. Shit, sorry. So, <laughs> horse guy decides to TK because that's what he can do. <clears throat> that being said, yeah, pretty much complete re reset on this objective. Security is set up. They've got turrets. They have, hopefully, mines somewhere. Actually, I don't see any mines. Just the one turret inside. Yeah, did, did we miss like an, some sort of honorable rule to not place mines tonight for one team? I, like, I don't understand what's going on. Um, now mines are not very effective in this room because usually as security you want to be in this room. Instead you want to be placing it at the entrances to the room uh, because that's where you, know, down. If you can cut a guy's health down to 20%. Fuck yeah, do it. They have put a mine down in front of the objective now, so I didn't see who planted it. Yeah, but again, I, I actually Hold don't on. like that because, um, you know, yeah, you're going to catch the one guy that's going to rush up, and that's fine, but this doesn't seem uh, terribly effective. In fact, Horse Guy comes up and removes oh. the mine and places one of his own. This is a great spot for a mine. I actually like placing one right near this plant where, as you can see, right there, uh, Superlink ran through, right between the boxes. Uh, and the wall, that can be such an effective place to put a mine because I guarantee you'll get at least one guy, if not two, uh, security rushing back to try to recover the objective. By the way, are the mines actually color-coded? I just not noticed that until now. I, I sort of thought it before, but I never really looked at it. But I think, I think they, yeah, they're, they're red and blue. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. The tide is gone, so they're down, down one guy. Yeah, that might, that might be a an issue. Ten minutes though, he might come back. Or did he say GGs? Uh, no, it was an authenticate user, so I'm sure he'll be right back. Okay. So yeah, here here's a resistance mine. Mostly red. Oh, maybe maybe not. Maybe they are the same, and I'm just hoping. Hold on, horse. <laughs> the operative yeah. actually saw the mine just before. Yep. Yeah. I saw him back off. Yeah. Whenever you see mine, you have to check. To see if you're about to get shot in the face. Because those tend to hurt. Bullets in the brain tend to hurt more. That being said, this objective is clear. Riptide's back on the resistance. So I can't help but wonder if Bruins Spitfire has put on the yellow face paint in honor of his favorite hockey team today. I would or not be that's surprised. Usually, how he goes. Yeah, that's a good, good question. So where, where is the resistance? Seriously, I've not seen their faces for quite some time. Hop out and take a look at the courtyard. There we go. Watch out, for this. Well, Spitfires slowly making his way back in with no backup. Uh, oh, Ender's behind him. Yeah, they're actually trying to make a two-man push. Turn into one-man push, back to a two-man push, but... Oh, nice knockdown. Super links back up, though. Able to get the final word on Ender Wigan. <clears throat> Except... Indeed, Bruins will, uh, get things done and start the hack once more. Oh, 9.37 nice on the clock as that hack begins. But it needs to be pretty solid. Here comes the detonation of all the mines with faces. Horse guy getting a kill. Riptide able to recover the room. Can they hold it though? That is the question. We got security spawning fresh. Spitfire on the hack. Three security about to press in. Let's see if they can make it through the gauntlet. Down go two. Riptide and Burra uh T King. Wow, that is a done deal right there. <clears throat> All right. Riptide also picking up two more kills. Well, Infobiter can get in and on. And he's 
attacking again from his favorite spot. That being said, he has to keep pulling out his weapon in order to protect himself. He's back to the hack. Can I get some help? Thank you. And let's see where security's at with the next push. It's all about info, Biter. Horse goes down, Riptide Watch runs. Spy coming in. Too sweet. Still hacking. Able to get into Wigan, but I don't know. Riptide able to clean up. So we should be pretty close here. Let's see where we're at. Oh, actually, only 6%. A lot more yep. interruption than uh, I thought. She spread Kenny save the day. Down. Kills off Warhammer, sublinks in. Horse guy poking out way too far and gets taken down. So, I think Hello. security mm -hmm. might have a chance to dehack here. Now is the time. She spread is timing out. I think. <laughs> but yeah. Either way. Either way, we're getting a dehack. That's all that matters. Two guys are on it. 20%. Down to about 10%, but look how much slower it is. It's so nice. Yeah, it does actually take quite a while, doesn't it? Yeah. That being said, here comes the resistance. It, again, it did require two engineers to get it down that far. And she spread it. Just did time out. So, we are playing a four against five Coming. right now. Riptide's picked up the hack again. Not a user. I wonder what that's all about. Seen that before. And looks like Warhammer will put the hurt down on Man Smells. Okay. Infobiter's team killing. Uh, yeah, why not? Why not, right? It's, it's, sure. a good, it's a good motivator. There's still lots of time. <laughs> With that heavy just. Yeah. Okay, Potential so Info is working on the... Nope, he's down. So yeah, Sup uh, Supa... I don't really seem to do much with the whole medic thing yet. Oh, there we go. Actually, as I speak, he gets up Burra, so... Cheers. And Man Smells. I just need to shut the fuck up. <laughs> I just had not seen it. My apologies, Mr. Medic. We got Ender Wigan contemplating the uh, press in again. Security has retaken the objective. Five minutes left on the clock. And this is getting down to the wire now. What was a 12 minute endeavor now down to just five. Security putting on the hero hold mode action. They've almost got the hack box down to zero again. Yeah, this is quite a difficult objective because again let us just recap i'm actually gonna run off and and go go uh I'm for you guys. just kind of refresh the memories for those that, that aren't aware i might die pretty much um resistance There's a sniper spawns, like over here roughly right and they have to oops wrong way <laughs> oh me i'm lost Shit. well anyway they have to they have to trudge all the way down this alley, across this bridge, into the courtyard, across the courtyard, and then they're finally at the hack ejector. I mean, it's just so ridiculous. Like, I, I'm all understanding about, like, maybe me to tweak stuff when it comes to games coming out and switching up between pub play and competition, but just the sheer run times, like, why is it that defense in almost all cases has by the end of several maps a five a second run time and then right. offense has a 20 second flat out dead heat run before they even get to the objective i, I don't understand how that made it through playtesting they must have been some completely like thumbless retarded monkeys playing <laughs> on the playstation 3 no offense to you playstation 3 users but i'm sorry if you're in the hey, playtest <laughs> if you were in the beta test, how did you not call this out and just say this is completely not right? Well, I can explain this. Okay. No, I really can't. Alright. It's unacceptable, you know. Yeah. It, no, it, it just doesn't make any sense. Because, like, I, I can understand, again, if something is not right for competitive play, but it 
fits for pub, fine. But it's even fucked up in pub play. So it just doesn't make sense to me. Sure. That means that we have a hack going down. Yep. Actually, Bruins was working on it, uh, and he's actually doing a pretty good job of holding it down in there. Yeah, Rip, Rip out, and we're back at the is, Wow, good job. Yeah. Go for it, Rip. Back at the 50%. That being said, the Riptide's that usually as, and actually pretty much as always, the last guy standing. And he needs to really pick a different hiding spot. At this point, it's not even a hiding spot. It's just a spot. It's his favorite spot. Yeah. At, at this point, it has, like, all kinds of oil and really disgusting stuff. And you see him moving in the flashbang, and, oh, Burra getting cortexed. But most importantly, Mansonel is able to start a D-hack. Gets pushed off by Warhammer. Warhammer losing cover and about to get shot in the back, I think. There it is. Down he goes. Man smells about to de-hack. Oh, maybe not, though. Here comes Bruin. Bruin needs to hold this down. Needs to get the kill. If he dies, this will be de-hacked. 1 minute 45. This is their last chance. Riptide should be coming in, though. They need to get this done. A minute 37. Bruin thin. Yeah, yeah Riptide is about to hack. Riptide. This might be it. Yeah. 70%. Riptide 80%. They need to cover. They need to cover these operatives. 90%. It's going to get done. Work their way down in the background there. Uh, Riptide's going for. There it is. Nice. Minute 10. Yeah, very nice. Very yeah. nice. Computer. Now we can finally get help from outside. So, yeah, it, it's job, not impossible brothers. to win this map. But I feel like, um... Did you guys hear that? It, it just... Horn or was that something... just doesn't feel right. That was the boat. That's the, that's the boat pulling way. Honk honk, bitch. I don't think I've ever noticed that before. <laughs> beep, All beep, right. I'm a boat. It was just that I've won that so few times that... Anyway, yeah, exactly. You can hear on TeamSpeak. It's like, yeah. I've just never won that you guys were still ever. One. So I didn't know that you did a little beep Thanks. beep on the way out. You know, a little final fuck you to the <laughs> to the security for, <laughs> the, for stealing their nice um, nav computer. Uh, have yourselves a great night, folks. Thanks for tuning in. And uh, we will see you this Sunday, hopefully. Good night. And everybody. And if you're not with us, uh, happy Father's Day uh, Sunday.